guys, just to give you a little update, I don't know if you can see the lightning behind me, but there's a storm coming. So I have to get off the water as quick as possible. Uh, I took down my sail. And I took down all my fishing rods and I put it down. Normally this isn't an issue, but to my north, west, and south, I see lightning. So I'm right in the middle of it, and even though there's no lightning around me, at any time the weather could shift a little bit and it could be right on top of me. So on the way back, I'm gonna stop by a rockfish spot, fish for about 30 minutes or an hour, see how many fish I can get, and then let's go home. Okay guys, so we're just arriving at the spot. And here's our first fish. Oh my gosh. I caught Patrick. I caught Patrick the star. It's raining now. This is a weird weather day.
This is a rock band. That's why the rock band does it fell. Okay guys, so we're back home. I filleted all our fish. I separated the collars and the fillets. And I'm about to fillet my lingcod that I caught. So it's been a couple days, but you can still tell the slime is still on the fish. The eyeballs are still clear. While I was at the beach, I removed all the guts. So we have all these got some smaller flays, medium flays, larger flays. But that's 
That's some good meat right there. Some fish tacos, some steamed fish. Okay guys, so that's one of the fillets. It's amazing how it looks like a blue salmon fillet. Two totally different species. And once you break it down into fillets, it kind of looks very similar. Except, wow, look at this blue meat, huh? Pretty amazing. All right, guys, so that's going to do it for this episode today. Thank you for watching. We have our beautiful blue lingcod here. Then we have our flaky white rockfish fillets. And all our collars. So thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time.